All right, guys, here is a little bit of a tip if you are breeding. Um, it's important to have shelves like this. I use the under the cabinet style lights. I prefer the ones that are a lot bluer, the 6,000 Kelvin. Um, I can shut the shelf off individually. I have both my female Theraphosne Panama there, and there's a male right in the middle. And the whole point of this is that their eyes are pretty much just responsible for seeing um, light differences. So for seeing that it's day or it's night or there's something above them, you know. So, um, yeah, just a little tip. If you're going to practice breeding, you should probably have an area where they can be dark and quiet. And light on here. I actually just have a rag over the temporary enclosure the male's in. He's uh he's somewhere in there in the back. Yep, he's in the back corner of over there. It's gonna be impossible to see, just take my word for it. But um the whole point of that is that they feel more comfortable to come out and explore and look for him. And actually the last time that I bred these females I woke up in the morning and both the females were on the glass like right next to him. So different male, different time, but just a little hint. Also, if you have high strung tarantulas, um, having a closed cabinet is really cool because you can just keep them in here. And then if you want to show people, you can just put lights in there and turn them on temporarily. I have a Pamphibedius ultramarinus that's probably going to molt. Uh, Kilobrachys fimbriatus that I just got, and she's actually webbing pretty heavy, which is nice. Uh, Pseudnosinemus brachyromosa, which is a, I think, is actually the smallest blue tarantula. And this one, as far as I know, is a female, because she's about adult size and has no uh, male accessory organs. And these two males are actually available. I have a Tilotocatl vagans and a... Uh, a phone of Pelma Calcodes. If you are in the northwest of the United States, let me know. And then my very first freebie that ended up being a female. This is... Um, Tiltocatol Subalosum. Which is the fuzzier version of the Baggins. Very neat. Not for sale. Unless you convince me to. Alright. This little tip. Have shelves that can shut off individually.